guys, RC here. Welcome to a new Let's Play. I do want to adjust some of these volumes down to where they're not too cumbersome. Now, I am just opening the game for the first time. This is called Two Point Hospital. Now, I became aware of this game because the people that made it made an older game that used to be a DOS-based game called Theme Hospital. And it was in line with, uh, you know, a lot of the theme games of the time. So this is one that they have been working on for a little while. And uh, I heard about it. I've been kind of following it. And it just released today. So I am uh, recording this on Thursday, August 30th, 2018. And uh, so, yeah, it just came out this today. I downloaded it this morning. I had it downloaded and installed while I was out working today. I just got home from work. So I am just sitting down, getting comfortable, ready for a extended week vacation uh, so i'll be off tomorrow and then all of next week uh, labor day and uh, all the way and then i have jury duty my first day back out of vacation so i get another day off of work uh, but anyway uh, so probably going to be playing a lot of this over the next week figured i'd go ahead and start a new let's play so let's get into it again all i've done to this point is i've opened the game i opened the settings and adjusted the volume. So let's start a new game. At Two Point Hospital, over 52% of our patients believe they leave healthier than when they arrived. Our precisely calibrated equipment is operated by compassionate healthcare practitioners, many of whom have even been to medical school or watched ER. If you suffer from turtle head, let us ease your worries and noggin gently out of your body. Just infection is no <laughs> laughing matter. Put your trust and oversized shoes in our capable hands. We're building a brighter, safer future, and hardly anything will stand in our way. You deserve the best. So join us at Two Point Hospital. We're open for new staff, new patients, and a new you. Can I go play golf yet? Can I go play golf yet? Nice. So a lot of comedy in it, and that harkens back to the uh, theme hospital days. Um, I have seen a couple of other people do some preview Let's Plays. But uh, yeah, anyway, we're just going to jump right into the game. So there are basically what the game does is you build a hospital, you set it up, you know, you design it and you place uh, equipment and build rooms and everything else. And you can see here we have a hospital here, and then we have another hospital up here. And there are several islands out this way, and they all have different uh, you know, levels of, you know, that require to open it. And I'm sure it does uh, also entail... Okay, WASD works. Awesome. Uh, you have to get a certain score to open the next level. So basically, uh, I don't know if additional hospitals open up beyond these four or five. Uh, four of them, it looks like. So not sure about that. We'll figure it out. But anyway, I, what I'm thinking about doing is we will start and, and this hospital will be one let's play however many episodes we decide to go and i know there are certain goals that you have to meet you can continue playing past that point and that's uh you know that's probably what we will do uh, we will work on this hospital as as our first episode first series and then the next hospital will be a completely different let's play and we'll just pick up at that point uh so anyway let's get into it uh, let's click on learn the basics. So we'll walk through the basics together. We start off in the community of Hogsport. And let's get started. So we're going to set up our first hospital. Uh, I'm not ready, but we'll start anyway. All right, so it will have a slight tutorial, so we'll go through that. 
WASD, hold the right mouse button and drag, zoom with the wheel button. All right, so there, there. All right, all right, so we need a reception desk. So we've done all the tutorial stuff and now we get the prompt. So we need a reception desk, all right? So we are going to build an item, a reception desk. No. Now, rotate the item, hold the left mouse button. There we go. All right, so kinda, let's come over here. Kind of want this, I'm thinking right about there. All right. We need to hire someone. So we want an assistant. Now, the more skilled they are, the more they cost. But then some of them have these additional skills. So customer service and customer service two customer service customer service two and stamina training do i want to pay double for stamina training i don't think so but we will hire her and we will drop her right there so she'll get to work all right we need a general practitioner's office build a room click on the room button all right GP office. So what I want to do here is now you kind of got to think. So here's our whole hospital, right? Now we can buy. Mm, I know in later hospitals that you can buy additional buildings. So I don't want to go overboard, but let's go ahead and I want to build a right there. And let's go ahead and put our door. Come on, I can't line that up center. Please, hello. And yeah, we'll put it right there. Okay, there we go. Just slightly off center. Put that in the corner. Click the green. Oh, there we go. Click the green tick. There we go. All right, now we need to hire a doctor. And let's see. So 15% diagnosis skill. That's probably important for the GP office, right? Mm. Patients are reminded not to think about it. This is Clinton Hawthorne on two point Mo oh, speed and efficiency. I'm going to go ahead and hire the middle guy here, Toby. All right, so our hospital's open. So basically, they will come into the receptionist, they will be sent to the GP, and I want to hire. Oh, you know what? Let me. No. Where's my settings? Data view. No. Options. There we go. Um, settings. DJ volume, let's turn that off. I don't want to be in violation of anything there. So the DJ, I saw it brought up some music over there. Just don't want to be in violation. So I will turn that all the way off. Even though it's in the game, uh, I just don't want to even get started. All right, I do want to buy items though. I want to buy a bench. We're going to buy two of those. We're going to buy a bin. 
and I think that's enough for right now. All right, so we just got 500 bucks for diagnosing him. Now, the GP has sent us a message, so we have to build a pharmacy. But let's read the message. All right, pharmacy required. So we've discovered a new illness, the grout. Transmitted in bathrooms, that sounds uh, very contagious. Has to be dug out with a screwdriver in earlier times. Ouch. All right, so get patient to wait. All right, so we want to build a room. And why don't we, why don't we build the pharmacy on this side? Zoom back in. Please try not to panic. All right. So I need to hire a nurse. All right, she has 20% pharmacy increase. First, please go to the pharmacy. So we can hire her, the cheapest one. There we go. And I'm going to go ahead and put a couple of more benches over here if they need to wait there. And I think that's good. All right, so there you see the nurse spinning up the drink, the drug mixer. She'll give it to the patient. And we've got another patient over here with the grout. And another patient already in here. So we've cured a patient and unlocked an achievement. All right, so you earn some money for that. So we'll continue diagnosing. Now, just like a regular hospital, you'll need to, uh, well, let's see. They say that you will improve your hospital reputation by curing patients. This will attract more patients, which will in turn bring more money. All right. So hire a janitor. All right. So let's hire. 30% maintenance skill. I'm going to go ahead and hire Bella. And items. A fire extinguisher. Do I want to put this right there? Hmm. No, all right, well, well, we'll make do with one for right now. All right, so our nurse, our janitor's walking around cleaning. Our doctor's waiting on stuff. Now, if we mouse on him, you can see his happiness and his stamina are going down. So eventually they're going to tell us to... Let's see. Good. They're going to need to take a break. So we'll need to build a break room at some point. But we'll wait for the prompts here. Oh, place two extinguishers. Okay. So how about if we put this inside his office? That's good. Keeping people happy. All right, patients will get bored, thirsty, and hungry. Give them entertainment, food, drinks, and a comfy seat for between appointments. If they become unhappy, they will go to another hospital. Well, I've already done two benches. All right, so we want a leaflet stand. I'm going to put that right in the middle so they can get that. A drink machine. Oh, that's not what I want. Now, can I put it right? Yes, I can. So we're going to put that right there. Um, you know what? I'm going to pick that up. 
I'm going to put that right there. And then we will, we will put a snack machine. Can I do that right there? Uh, it will not go. Doggone it. It will not go. All right, so you know what? We're going to do that. I'm going to pick that up. And we will put that right there. All right, so we're, we're good there. All right, so now we want to build a staff room. Why don't we put that over on this wall? And what else do we want to put in there? Sofa. We'll put a bin in here. We'll put a plant over here. And another fire extinguisher right there. And how about couple of armchairs right there might be overkill but that's fine you can place a member of staff in the staff room all right so let's take a look at him all right so we will pick him up we will put him in there and force him to take a break all right you have to put bins and toilets all right, we will close that. So we need to build a toilet now. So tell you what, I am going to build this right there. And then I want sinks on this side. There. A hand dryer. How about if we put two of those? And we can put a bin in that corner. I think we're good. Overkill, right? Overkill. So your janitor will also work on the maintenance for anything. So like we're doing fine right there. Uh, let's see, so a diagnosis room. All right, item controls we already did. General diagnosis unlocked. Where is... More GPs, more staff. All right, so it looks like our... Assistant is on break, so let's hire her and we need to build a general diagnosis. Let's do that. We'll put that here. An 
easy scan. That's that. Let's build a couple of uh, examination tables. Oh, I've already got that. Boy, I may have made that room too big, huh? Hmm. All right, well, let's do that. Nurse to general diagnosis. All right, let's hire another nurse. Uh, that's not what I want. I want to I want to hire another nurse. We'll hire Brandy and let's build a couple more no come on there we go and let's get one more bench right there I like my trash bins from what I remember about the game, just makes cleanliness a lot better. All right, build a second GP's office. All right, let's pause it here because we got a lot of things cramping up, right? All right, so I've hired two nurses. Now I want to hire another doctor. We'll just put them in the break room for right now. And I need to build another GP's office. Now, this area is kind of filled up. I do have... So why don't we do that? put a plant in there give him a trash bin in there and let's put a window let's put a window on each side and we will do that and then I will put a couple of benches right outside so he could see him through the window. How, how does that work for you? All right, so let's check. Award. All right, so they've got a new illness called bed face. All right, so we need a ward. I think we'll build the ward back here. And the ward is typically going to be pretty big. I don't want to use that entire width, but let's do that. We'll go there. We'll put the nurse in the corner here, like that. And then... I think that's that's three beds. And I'm going to go ahead and put an extinguisher out here. We're going to build that room. I'm going to build another drink machine. 
a snack machine and a bench and let's put another leaflet stand right about there and we need a nurse here too right so let's hire another nurse don't need anybody fancy for that all right now we'll unpause it multiple beds okay i think this room was too big yeah see i don't yes oh well we're good to go all right Ten bucks for a drink. That's awesome. All right. Bogwarts. Going to the pharmacy. All right. So we're not filling up in there just yet. You want to kind of keep an eye on, on your cues. Now, this first hospital, it's not going to be that difficult. But we will continue you know we could possibly add a second machine in there get two nurses uh oh what's wrong with him he's got the clamp Treatment failed. We had a 94% success rate. Oh, no. All right, so we need $1,200 more to reach the next level. All right. Oh, $6,000. Oh, but he's going to die. Bogwarts is going to kill him. No. He's dying. He died in the hospital. No. All right. So continue to expand. All right. Well, this is a good place for a cut. So we are paused. We will come back to here in a moment. I will see you guys in the next episode. Leave a like for the video. Subscribe to the channel. Uh, if you know, let me know what you think about the game, the series. Uh, you know, if you know if you played Theme Hospital previously. Let me know what you thought about that game, because it's very similar. A lot of this is all identical from what I remember back in the day. So, guys, thanks so much, and we will see you next time. Take care. Bye.